super cute and easy New Year's Eve makeup and outfit look. I really hope you guys enjoy. This is super, super easy, and I feel like every girl has something similar to this outfit already in their closet, and the makeup look seriously took me, like, less than 10 minutes, which is really great for something that looks really nice. So I really hope you guys enjoy, and let's get on with the video. So first thing I'm going to be doing is taking my Naked Skin Foundation by Urban Decay and mixing it with my Cetaphil Oil Control Moisturizer. I'm just going to dot this all over my face and I'm taking a dampened beauty blender and I'm just going to blend this out. So next I'm going to be applying my concealer. This is the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I am in the color Light. And I'm also going to be applying it on any blemishes that I have. Now I'm just going to take my ring finger and blend out my under eye concealer. And I'm also taking my ring finger to blend out the concealer that I put everywhere else. You want to make sure that when you're doing this you pat and not smear it around and rub it because then it'll lose all its coverage. I'm taking a brand new beauty blender. This one is dry. And I'm using this with my Master Fix powder by Maybelline. And I'm just dipping it into its little container and then putting that straight under my eyes. So I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Perfect Brow Pencil and mine is in the color Caramel and I'm just going to be filling in my eyebrows very lightly. So continuing with the face, I'm taking my Shade and Light palette by Kat Von D. I'm going with the middle shade, which is called Shadow Play, and taking an angled blush contour brush and putting this as my bronzer. So I'm just taking a normal blush brush and going in with my Becca and Jaclyn Hill palette, and I'm taking the Luminous Blush color and putting that on the apples of my cheek. And last but not least for the face, I'm taking my Ingold blush brush again and going in with the Champagne Pop Highlighter. So the rest of my face is pretty much done. So now we are going to do eyeshadow, which I'm going to be using the Sex Bomb Palette by NYX. I'm going in with a crease brush. I'm going in with the taupey nude color as my transition. And so now taking this eye contour, kind of like a pencil brush, I'm going in with the sparkly black color on this really small brush and I'm applying this onto the outer corner of my eye. And now I'm taking the matte black and putting that right onto the very, very outer corner of my eye. Then taking my fluffy crease brush, I'm going to blend that out. So now I just mix a little bit of the taupe color and the sparkly black and I'm putting that more towards my inner corner. To get that beautiful New Year's sparkle and glow, I am taking my ring finger and going back in with Champagne Pop and putting that straight onto my eyelids. And there you have a beautiful glow, and I'm still going back in the Champagne Pop and putting that in my inner corner. So for my eyeliner, I'm taking the CoverGirl Perfect Point Plus eyeliner, and I'm putting this onto my tight line. And to finish off the lashes, I'm taking my Thero Primer by Benefit, and I'm putting that on my lashes, and this is going to be my mascara. Now we can go back to the under eyes and remove it, so I am taking my big fluffy powder brush and just sweeping under my eyes. And now going back with my shade and light palette and a small under eye powder brush, I'm going in with the color Lyric and putting that under my eyes. Lyric just helps give them a really nice, bright, and awake effect. Now I can go back with my Thera primer and apply this onto my lower lashes. On New Year's, go big or go home, so I'm taking my Ardell Glamour Lashes and they are the Wispies, which is really nice since we didn't do any winged eyeliner. So now that I have my false lashes on, I'm taking my Too Faced Melted Lipstick in the color Fig, and it's just this really pretty purple color just to add a pop of color to our makeup look. And for the final step of our look, as we are counting down to midnight, we want to make sure that our makeup stays on and we don't look super greasy or crazy after partying, so I'm taking the NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray and just putting this all over my face. This is what I wore on New Year's Eve, and it's just a super cute and pretty black swing dress from Macy's, and it has really pretty jewel detailings by the neck. And for my shoes, I'm just wearing some cute heels by Kelly and Katie. That is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you all have a super happy New Year, and don't forget to like and subscribe, and comment down some videos that you'd like to see during 2017. I'll see you on my next video. Bye!